In today's video, we're going to take a look at uh, MU, Micron, and when the market does have a pullback like this, the first question that uh, most people are going to ask is, this a or an opportunity to buy at cheaper prices, or is it just going to continue to roll over and die? Well, I don't know the answer to that question, but I do know that I can set up some parameters where you can watch for a potential uh, re-entry in this stock using uh, symmetry and the other price relationships that I like to run. So I'm going to start by running the um, symmetrical projection of that prior larger decline and then the swings within that swing. Okay, and while well, you're slightly through that 53.96. Um, what else can we do? We can run the retracements and see if there are any overlapping retracements. The most recent swing will be important. Okay, so you have a 382 retracement that overlaps that general area. Then let's see what else might overlap um, the symmetry. And there's a smaller swing where we can run the retracement this prior low to this high. Okay, and that actually gives you a 618 retracement that overlaps. So bottom line, as long as price holds within this general range of um, 5105 to 5396, I would go down to the lower time frame charts and look for buy triggers. If you get one, you can take the trade and then your risk definition would be either underneath the low made prior to your buy signal or underneath the low end of the zone, which in this case would be underneath 5105. So you want to be careful, you know, it could get ugly Monday morning. It's hard to tell. We're already very extended, but um, you know, it, it, it could get worse than that. So. Bottom line, make sure that this general zone holds, and then if it holds, look for the trigger.